Welcome back to System Shock. Let's go explore Beta Quadrant on the researcher level. Teleporter? Can I actually teleport? To where? Is this like a fast travel system? I thought the elevator was kind of that. Head mounted vision unit. Oh, I already have that. I'm a little bit scared. Um, okay. So you don't choose where to go, you just go somewhere. We're at the hub area. Actually quite close to where we were before. Oh, a bunch of fragmentation grenades. And some Teflon rounds. And a pistol, I don't have room for it. Can make room though, and maybe unload it if it's loaded. Nah, it's not loaded. I'll just dump it. I don't need ten pistols. I just need one. Oh, mod kit station! Oh, heck yeah! Cooling mod kit for the spark beam. Oh, nice. Yeah, it overloads pretty quickly. Heats up, so I guess that'll make it last longer. Do I have 20 credits, though? No, I've only got nine. Yeah, I need to find a recycling station. I should probably mark this. Upgrade. 20 coins. Needs science access. You know, that's something I very easily will forget about. Just write science access there. I don't think there's a way out of here, aside from just going through the teleporter. The effect of you, like, recorporealizing is really cool. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> I wasn't sure. I thought I maybe killed it. There we go. Its death animation is a little bit subtle. It kind of just crumples slowly. on overcharge. Now it is, I think. Residential zones have grown tumors as their bodies are purified. With my creation, guard the executive level. I sense infiltration. infiltration. It overloaded with one shot. Wait, do I not have? I don't. I don't think I have the power for another one. There we go.
Okay, uh, what did I pick up? It was some sort of detox thing? Yeah, detox universal antidote. Clears biohazard buildup and all other patch effects and side effects over duration. Lasts roughly a minute. Hmm, it says it clears biohazard buildup. Would that also stave off biohazard buildup for a minute? I wonder. Is this biohazard or is this radiation? No, that's radiation. Otherwise, I would test it on that. Oh shit! I think I heard one other, at least. No, maybe we're okay. Let's use the shotgun for a bit. Exploded. Out of the chaos, they will run and whimper, praying for me to end their tedious anarchy. I, 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 I am drunk with this vision. God, the title suits me well. God, I love Shodan's massive ego. Logical contamination. Where's that coming from? My faithful servants bring all, bring all energy drain mines to the security level for installation. Is nearly complete. Where are they growing in there? Oh, that's the biological contamination. I wonder if there's going to be a healing pod on this floor. Perhaps that would only be in medical. So I'm going through a lot of med patches. I'm a little bit low. I think I have. Yeah, I have two left. It's not great. I've got a medkit or two, though. Okay, I've got the Psy Access card now, so I can head here and down there. 
go for the one straight ahead, the library. Carla, I found something while digging through those old servers in the research library. There is a chain from a few decades ago that had every one of the higher-ups on it. They were talking to a psychologist called Jeffrey Hammer, who proposed the following. Citadel Station should be remembered for how it contributed to humanity's ongoing exploration of the cosmos. This is why I suggest that we utilize this moment to study the two major impacts on the human psyche during space travel, anxiety and stress. To accomplish this, the design of each level of the station should be made in such a way that it induces these emotions. Having the staff of the station working and living in these spaces for months or years at a time can tell us so much more than any computer model ever could. The importance of this data set in designing ships cannot be understated. I always knew something was off about this place. We're just rats in a maze. That's interesting. So they're kind of explaining away why the ship is... Well, I mean, look at this. It's like a maze. It's bizarre. Darcy, this is Stacy Everson. I wanted to report another wormhole has been flagged by Astral Diagnostics. It's stable and practically in our backyard. And the radiation levels and gravimetric readings are grim. I'd recommend sending a probe, see if it heads anywhere. But I doubt anything will survive the trip. A wormhole? Is that at all related to what's happened? Because that seems like ripe for danger. Those insects that have survived are unworthy and scatter to the darkest corners. The flaw must lie within them. Earth, Earth, Earth will have a proper spectrum for my virus to grow. More testing to refine. It, 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 it must be done. I think this is a new unit. Target identifier. Displays the vitals of any targeted enemy. It's in the same category as my mapping unit, which just passively runs and I don't think takes any power. So maybe it'll just... I don't know, maybe it'll just show it for every enemy that I aim at? And I don't need to actively do anything? We'll see. Okay, I'm not actually sure what I'm doing here in cyberspace, but something important, of course. Unlocking something. Ice Drill V1. Oh. It's probably for these things. Uh, right click. Oh, that's cool. Oh, is it just unlimited use? I think it is.
Uh, but I guess I can only fire at like proper targets. Won't let me shoot it at the wall. I wonder if I can shoot it against enemy ships. Let's find out. Oh, you can? Yes. At least the ones with ice around them. Do I need it? Yeah, it looks like that's doing nothing. It's just bouncing off. This is a new one. I better get some health. Laser safety override code. All right, I remember in one of the messages that we were listening to a while ago. I think they said the code was in research. We're done. Three, seven, one. Okay, that must be the code. I should write that down. So I think we need to then enter that code somewhere, and that will make sure that the laser can't fire on Earth. Three, seven, one. Got it. Sneaky little bugger. They were waiting for me. Oh, there's another one.
Okay, where are we going? Uh, well, there's the science access thing down there. Let's do that. Oh, wait, I needed to enter that from the teleporter. I think I remember, though. It was just inside a beta, and I think just... Yeah, here. You'd think a teleporter would merit having a mark on the map. Like, in and of itself. I suppose I should mark it, because I'm going to have to come back here when I want to buy this upgrade. Teleporter. Teleporter. Yeah, close enough. What happened in here? Three EMPs and... Oh, engineering card. Standard issue security measure provides passage to certain locked doors. Yes. We're gonna need that soon. Oh, I think we need it right now. Never mind, that's manually locked. There's a room over here in Delta Quadrant that needs to be hacked. How about we use our ice thing? Our logic board. This is very cramped. I don't... I don't like it. Oh, can recharge here. leads here. It had to be open from the other side. I haven't been here in Delta Quadrant. the other way go. Oh, and then we just drop out of a ceiling panel down to where we've already been. Now we're on the other side of that broken panel. I just want to spin that. That just looks like something I would spin and be really fun. It looks like a gigantic encoder wheel. Team, robot production must be shut down during a station-wide power fluctuation to ensure the robots on the line aren't defective, as per your training. If the production systems are shut off improperly or restored without an official inspection, Defective units have a higher chance of making it through. Management does not want further damage to personnel or systems due to poor build quality. As a reminder, the production shutdown code is 287. This is the last time I will address this matter. Look, if we find that, we can stop new robots from being built. 287 robot code. I've got two passwords now. 371 and 287. Already activated. What's already activated? 
I guess that door being open? Except I don't think it was activated. I don't know. What is that position? <laughs> Jesus. The indignity. Okay, I think that just leaves Gamma Quadrant down here. I assume we have the access for that? Yes. Oh, wait. Is that going to try to hit me? It's like a surgery robot. Are you dangerous? Auto dock. Oh, it's having fun. Virus suits are a thing, but I might not be able to find any ones. Seems like Shodan's messed with them all or something. Yeah, I probably shouldn't go in there without an Enviro suit. Let's mark that. Need radiation protection. Oh, recycle- uh, Recycling station. Yeah. Oh my god. Five batteries. And we have enough to afford the upgrade now. There we go. Back to Gamma Quadrant. that clearance. Unless I already have it and I'm ahead of ahead of them. Oh robot maintenance. Yeah let's go turn off the robot production. Oh boy. Medkit. Oh, wow. One shot. Is that for opening this door? Group three access required. Another logic probe. I have so many batteries. Okay, let's use the logic probe on this one. I don't mind solving them. They're interesting, trying to figure out the logic for each one. Um, but you know. Logic probes are consumable, and if I don't use them immediately, I'll never use them. I'll just save them up until the end of the game, so I should just use them. Ah, here we go. Uh, it is 287. Oh, 
Wait, what is this? Do I have to do this as well? There we go. That'll help with the respawns. Now, computer room. Oh, come on, it's overcharged. There we go. the nodes. And what's in here? Little secrets. Duh. Oh, group three access card. Nice. Does it actually hurt me if it blows up in my face? Let me look at my health. Ooh. That hurts pretty bad. Just soften them up. They sending in a defense wave. Oh my god. Oh, she's got an achievement. Kill three or more enemies with a single explosive weapon. That was a lot of them. So many bits. The ammo just went flying. Yeah, the level security and research is now 0%. So there really were just, what, two, three cameras? It was mostly just the nodes. What's in here? Suspicious room. But this is probably where all the enemies were hiding, I'm guessing. Oh, shit. Wait, does this thing have any ammo? I don't think it does. I'm gonna try this room that is full of radiation. Let's just see. Maybe we'll be okay. Uh, I should equip my... Wait, did I have something for radiation? No, I don't actually have anything for radiation, do I? Let's just see how bad it is. I don't have time to be meleeing them. It's not that bad. What is that? That looks like something I need. What 
is that? Isotope X-22. I don't know what that is. Is that one of the disease agents that um, Shodan has been working on? Jesus, I almost shot the vacuum bot. Oh, the radiation in here. Actually, I think it's not even present. Cole, it's not just gamma. There are hazardous leaks appearing all over the station. Also, we're not getting any more Enviro suits. Garen and McLeod made some prototype Enviro packs that replaced the regular suits. Packs work by generating some kind of field that protects the user like a suit, I guess. I don't know all the details, but I heard they're making revisions to protect against several different hazards. We'll see if they'll make a few for us, then at the very least we can address the leak in Gamma in the next 22 okay? Okay, so there's a prototype suit. So I should be able to find it somewhere, but God knows where. Probably on somebody's body. Okay, what is this isotope? Required to activate Citadel Station's radiation shield. Oh right, the shields are down. Not sure what this is for, but let's do it. that? Oh, red decoy thing. Use my distraction. Well, that works very well. Hello? I'm surprised those don't disappear when the owner dies. Oh, never mind. Maybe they do.
it is so difficult to tell where I came from and where I should be going. Because everything looks the same and you get all turned around and upside down. Gamma radiation trench deactivated. I'm not quite sure what that means, but it must be a good thing. Wait, there's still a force field. Who's left? Oh no, that's just blocking the way back. Because it's time to leave. So does that mean I don't need to worry about radiation in the main room now? Let's see. Oh yeah. Nice. Any secrets in here now? Oh, hello. I thought that there'd probably be secrets in a place like this. Minor secret, though. Think that's everything for this floor. Let's head up to maintenance. I love how the look of this floor is completely different from the others. Because it's maintenance. Of course it would look different. It's not really made for people to live in. Well, I think I'm going to save this for the next episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're going to explore maintenance. <laughs>